In this video, we will explore the types of ticket submission in Zendesk. This is an important feature that will help you navigate best throughout the ticket submission process. There's plenty of options, so let's just jump right in. Let's imagine you just created a ticket, and after customizing it, you want to submit it. Before submitting, just click on the arrow next to the Submit as New button, and a menu will appear. This menu contains all the types of ticket submission. The first option is new, in this case the ticket is waiting an assignment to an agent. A new ticket is one that has just been created and has not been opened or assigned to any agent yet. The second option is open, in this case the ticket has been assigned and is actively being worked on. An open ticket means an agent is responsible and the issue is in progress. The third option is pending, in this case the ticket is waiting for a response from the customer. A pending ticket means the agent has replied and is awaiting the customer's input or action. The fourth option is ask for copy of invoice. This is a custom status used internally. It indicates the agent is waiting for the customer to send a copy of their invoice before proceeding. The fifth option is ask customer to send product. This is another custom status. It means the agent is waiting for the customer to ship the product, likely for return, inspection, or replacement. The sixth option is on hold. This means the ticket is waiting on a third party, not the customer. It's used when internal teams or external vendors need to take action before the agent can proceed. The seventh option is solved. This means the agent has resolved the issue and considers the ticket complete. The customer can still reply if needed, which would reopen the ticket. And that's it. These ticket statuses help agents track where each request stands in the support process. Using them correctly ensures faster, more organized customer service. Like and subscribe for more Zendisk tutorials.